Hello, welcome back to Formula 1 2023, my team to the episode 38, Stephen Lee. And it's going to be um, a quite exciting this time, but we know there is no Latin Asian change uh, coming into last season. So everything, everything pretty much stays the same. And you can see the man have got is 14.84 million. And that was also due to um, the achievement that I've got from my uh, main sponsor, which I got about 11.5 million. So that obviously helped out in a big time. And we also leased on um, Theo Porsche. So um, it's, it's a good day for us. We definitely need to be able to use, you know, that spend money on some spe on newer spec on all the upgrades for the department. So I'm excited to get that one away. And also, um, talking of the sponsor, we have also got a brand new sponsor. So the sponsor we've got, so you can see the, the main sponsor, it, it's the on dynamic. And it's finished, the goal is to finish P8 or better in ton slots and championship. And, and I get about 727.9 thousand dollar weekly and then I get 9.42 million if I achieve the goal, which is, I think it should be about, uh, five mil, four mil more, uh, and then we got, we got a new, one new spot, two new spot to, with the to and two TP um, that has their name, but the first spot we need to complete and wait with no DNA within the team. And then Dan and Dio, it needs to qualify P15 or better. And then Tatian, we need to achieve top 14, finish the young way. So obviously, we, I'm going to definitely try to improve um, during this um, season. And also, I want to talk about expectation, which I've no written down as what in the one but in that what to put the uh, to stay and other than so the expectation obviously it includes all of those and then I need to make sure I get limited in penalty which has been the same from last season and then we need to um pretty much as a thing to pretty much the same I still really so that the, obviously the limited penalty is mine expectation but the whole thing what I would put down if that did not drop that but that's what I put down so um I'm gonna so show you the contract uh, the situation with our new team so as you see me and Theo we got a brand new team with with a little hint of as you see on this side I got a little hint of the pink ish with white and black and red and I do think there's a little olives in there as well and into over to my uh, car and literally I'm doing a show right now. I just do my literally with my my car looks absolutely banging. It got the like torso wise um like smash pacing type of thing on the top. We got uh, the fun ring, we got like orange in there, spot in black, spot black like, merchant. So I'm definitely liking this tar vibe to the definitely look better than last season tar, 100%, there's no doubt. So we've always been talking about Talada map. So then Talada for this season, we've got a couple uh, ways that come back. So we've got Bar like in Australia, North Angle Arabia, so you don't bar like Australia, so you got China who's finally come back. So this season is twenty twenty five and I know China coming in in twenty twenty four in real life, we got China, we got Miami that like return, we got Imola, Spain, Canada, Austria, Lake Britain, Hungary, and we have Davidor, the Belgium John, but we brought in Davidor, Malta, and then Taxit and Malta. And that Brazil and that's fine and then we have end up with Abu Dhabi. So you got the American the American long plan. So I'm definitely um, excited to see what we can do this season. And then over to um Matt Verstappen is still with the Red Bulls. Charles Leclerc has met Axel Martin to join Miss Daisy. 
to the place with Lewis Hamilton, who had to retire, Lando, still a Ferrari, George, still a McDavid, Sergio Padre is still in the, the board, Carlo Sainz, still a Ferrari, Valtteri Bottas is still out of the main run, Pierre Gatter is still in the Alpine, we've got Etiban Oton, who's gone to Aston Martin, to the place, Leclerc, we've got Holtenberg in uh, McLaren, we've got Nuti Tanona in the Alpine, and then we've got Ray to Joe, who's still in out of the main run, we've got Kevin McMaster, who's gone to Alpha Tauri, so they played a new team. We've got Alexander Albon at... He was not a uh, hat. Yeah, he was still in the hat. Yeah, he was still in the hat. We've got Nick the Free, who's going to McLaren. I'll tell you, the Free and Big 12 at McLaren do have a Nick the Free. Or the Piastri, not McLaren, to join um, Aston Martin. We've got Lance Law, who's now officially gone back into Formula 1 at the way for one year to battle to enjoy the hat. Don't know then Charles in the William. Don't know Liam Lawton still on William. And uh, we got Jay Who. So who is back in Formula 1 to be driving for Alpha Tauri and also Theo Porsche still in Bradley Racing. Definitely excited to see what um other thing do to go down this season. So right now what we're going to do is, I'm going to short all the updates that I need to get before we head over to um, Barde. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to do all of this quickly and I'll see you when I start tracking on to the update. So, what I put down is, we've got earlier unchecked voters um, for 8 days. We had driver training camp, which will help Theo. We're going to be 6 days to that basically end of it and we're going to head over so we are almost in the bottom so I'm gonna put all the updates I possibly can so what I'm going to do now I'm gonna do this spec we've got 14 million I can definitely you know buy as much as I can uh, obviously go for the cheap and one so I'm gonna go for this do that and then over the chassis which is uh, 4.7 the so person now stay the same 4.7 still the ability, I think I'm going to go for chassis. Get that, and then we get the power train. So that's all the money gone down already. So we get aerial chassis and power train, and over to RD. I'm going to get as much as I can. Because obviously, I can get more. To, we need the specially, and I don't have specially. So I'm going to go for the one that. Bit how perfect for me, get this, and then I'm going to get that. We are the worst team in on, on the grid, that's for sure, no doubt about that. Um, but I'm hoping we can push it through as much as I can. Get that 1000, uh, we can get this one. Ah, oh, damn it, we can't do any more. I find the one it's. Um, so we bought what we can, I mean we can save it, and then we can, yeah let's save that one. So we get one, two, three, four updates, and that should help me out a bit more, um, hopefully get me to go all the way back to, back to where William is. So I'm going to go through, and hopefully we get all the updates to come in, and the 301.1 million, that's a lot of money to, to come in, which I'm happy about. So all the spec, right, is that, help me get spec, the no you won't. So we need to get, basically one more update in spec two, and that will get to spec three, I'm assuming. So I get, we can do another one again. Uh, we can't do this one, we can't do this one. To this one to see it, so I get we can do the sheep one, uh, turbo. We get the other it one, do we get there? Which will come on, come in at the bar, but that's fine, really. So, hopefully, we get all the app, they be absolutely perfect for it. Please, please. Our new parts have completed without issue. Fantastic. They'll be on the car ready for the next race. So, we still got to wait for Aereo. But we still stuck the same place. This is kind of annoying. 
Um, da, 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 this now. Um, so the part like the history is uh, twice the um, but we are now probably tied on with them out for the manual and the ha. I think, yeah, and so we know the board absolutely not his shit up top. We went with David, the oil should join up as well, and Axel Martin behind with David, we went with Taladin, but while we are still the same together, the Alpine has even developed. Uh, William and the W after the manual had the finals, the hat stayed the same. After how the auto had the finals, so we got three more updates coming in, and they all should come in before Australia. Yeah, it should be. I don't think so. I think earlier we're coming, that thing coming before Australia, or actually, we're coming before Australia, but obviously, we know it by the Daniel Arabia. And then Australia. So I'm gonna head over do some practice section and I'll see you in qualifying. We're going to be um getting ready to clock on to qualifying and the, the unfortunate thing is obviously the day before we went into qualifying before the practice we had not been able to well I was supposed to improve them this shorty um them update to the car before we head into season three. But because I've been saving it just in case the Latin Lays and Chow, but turned out I was barely from Latin Lays and Chow, so I made me stay for keeping it. But we had in this late, um, basically still the worst team, uh, the 10th, but the 10th place, but uh, I have to say it, we are at the bottom uh, of the resource point, we are better than Alpha Tower. Do. But we got more upgrade coming in, and that should help me to get back to so where the William is. Um, so we got quite a good amount of distorted points, which is good. Um, so in the practice, that's in the tar. feels heavy. Honestly, it was so heavy. Do so I have to um, obviously move the uh, website of one racing stim uh, tar setup, um, and then I put the the best setup for the ballet. Um so I'm just hoping I can do it last year I finished P twelve. I'm hoping to finish better this season. Um and I know all the car that's for me, the main uh, William and the hat. Yeah, the hat are very quite similar. William's a bit better. So we have the opportunity that we can do better in the Qualifying, uh, hopefully, I can get up to 2 2, uh, put fairly 2 3, and try and hold that position as much as I can. So I'm doing a pop out and I'm going to do a third run. I actually finished my uh, third run uh, in. It went well, the P7, um, and we have how much the time? 1.29, which is true. To the uh, pack to finish 1.3, so 1.30, and I was not good. And I'm hoping to be able to keep this position. We finished ahead of Albon, we got loads and stars in you know, William show what that day to me that we are going to get locked out of the P16. Um, so I'm gonna diminish a bit more and hope, I mean, if Theo does well, I'd be happy about it. Uh, Philippe 20. I'd say so, I mean, I'm happy with who he's back, but he still has not improved it um, lately. He's still at the five, though he's not even improved at all. Um, but you know, it's nice to see who's back in form on the one, I don't even think they will act as the brain, but I mean, they got Philippe looking for it in the free ages. And I'm surprised it's not bringing in, um, but with Philippe 15, uh, we are going out to do a one on a new stock, 
to actually make sure I, I mean, two, one, two, two, it loose with the finish out of it. If I take the two, they could, but two, two, it definitely the priority might of a late of a season. Um, and then when I get up there, that beat the million, uh, basically nothing about it, that was better than that. that when I went to finish two, the most of the time. Um, so we got George, he's doing absolutely fantastic. We got like Claire. I mean, um, it can happen in real life. There were rumour that to be swapped with Hamilton over to Ferrari, like Claire over to McDavid. I actually didn't want that to happen at all. But I'm gonna go out, I'm gonna do um, a one, I start to run in six minutes. When we get to six minutes, we gonna, I'm gonna pop out. And I'm going to do my um, statue run to I see you at the end of the statue run. We've only got two laps of fuel left. Unfortunately, um, I should have done that one at the pull out. It was too many cars out there. Do I turn, um, tally on with it? But we improved the time from P. Deal 15 up to P8. So I'm hoping we can keep the time. So if I. <laughs> So he finished P15, unfortunately. Uh, I'm fairly sure with my dot barting. <laughs> they're the back now, they should be stopping that. I apologize if the dot barting hurts your bloody ear. They annoys me a lot with their barting. If the neighbor dot, they don't even bloody control them. But uh, with no to tar or shy dot bar, that can penalty them. Um, five weeks dot penalty to that lockdown to. There, I think. Do we pee I mean, we can do them for you. Um, I did. We can do them, but we can try and get up to pee. But it's pee time in the uh, bar lane. But I mean, I need to make the two two to that good. Um, so I don't. We should start to head over to the net. Um, while I'm playing, and hopefully we can do better. I don't do these all. I mean, obviously, finish ahead of our teammate that always been the party most of the time. And, uh, and I had, I, I'm apologizing, my daughter is absolutely annoying right now. Don't mind me, she's the one for you. It's not even there, deal of time to share. But yeah, so what I had done, I was seeing you when we got over to the long plane, and I will make sure that I do, uh, well, better improve. And get in place, but it's over there. My uh, object is that I need to finish P8 or better in terms of standing. So I need to finish in point or finish practically P11 most of the time uh, and point of torch. So I'm going to head over to the long plane and I'll see you at the end of the long plane. No more testing, no more practice. 
This is the real deal. And it's make or break here at round one of this year's Formula One World Championship. Formula One returns to the desert today on this exceptional 3.36 mile circuit. 15 corners provide plenty of overtaking opportunities and it could be a strategic race this one with Sakia notorious for eating up the rear tires. Watch out for drivers managing their rubber at some point during the Grand Prix. Before we begin, let's take a quick look at the grid lineup for today's race. A fantastic effort from Charles Leclerc yesterday, and it's put him on pole. And starting next to them is George Russell. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Verstappen, Perez, Oscar Piastri, Norris, Gasly, Albon, Holkenberg, Sonoda, Bottas, Sainz, Theo Porcher, De Vries, Ocon. Joe, Stroll, Liam Lawson, Sargent, Magnussen, and Jake Hughes. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. A new season then, a clean slate where anything could happen. Anthony Davidson is with me today as once again we get another year of Formula One underway. We're into those tense few minutes before the first race then. Everyone's a little bit nervous about reliability. They haven't been running in the hot, turbulent wake of other cars in practice. and They've not been pushing at 100% for long durations. Let's hope no one has to deal with any nasty surprises. We're going to be doing the easy track on two bar night long thing and we're going to be running on uh, a different, I mean these stops in medium stops to heart are the same map to come in anyway. But you know, obviously there's the potential chance for state in the car but for our VHD so we took actually looking to go into uh, that under the top or shorter, uh, shorter thing. So obviously I'm going to keep it a stop to medium because you know that pretty much the needable Slap and she can do and let the need to end in top with score the map earlier. I was all on hard, but it was well, better on hard than I'm on medium, but it goes longer and the tire is basically just um by the time it took to what lap twenty, just hard tire barely even being more where medium would be a bit more worn. So obviously I thought that I'm just gonna do medium, stop to medium, and I'm gonna try if we can save the tyre and go along to the end. That's what I'm planning to do. 25 North Lie, a bar way, and it's underway with Leclerc at the P1, and this Stappen has overtaken Jaw and overtaken Leclerc, and Jaw Loss has fallen down the order to P5 and up to PS. They didn't ready to make a move on Leclerc, they still real to real, and PS got ahead. And George has fallen down, but it's a shame as I obviously slaughtered trying to to uh, keep my really position with our bond was so slow. So I, I obviously to see I had a little wobble as I come out that acted and obviously Pierre overtook me but now I overtook him and now I'm getting ready to hunt down Alexander Albon for P8. So really good start for me but I'm really happy about and I'm hoping to be able to Obviously, move up through the field. I'm not expecting to get up to like P5 or something to the car, it's too quick. So, I'm getting not for the while where it butts that it was just P6. The P6 is not too shabby where I can go to. You don't forget, we got Orlando, the P7 Orlando, we're more likely to just go through the field with no issues. It's for our lead, that's a very strong team in terms of performance. So we have that potential chance where we can actually challenge the ha, but it's the ha, and William, and W, and one more team. I forgot what team we won. We all very close. Alpha Romeo. We all very close in terms of the performance, and Alpha Tower is obviously the worst, and I'm like the ten back of the lead. So obviously, with being okay, so close to the ha and the other tar and her. We do have a chance to be able to fight for points for P10, but P10 is still one point, a, a point is still a point for me, and it's so early in the season. So over the next lane, we got Pierre Daphnin taking a move down on me, as I'm not a lost position, and tried to overtake him, as I've done an absolutely beautiful overtake on Pierre Daphnin, but the dive bomb on the inside, 
got that really smooth and everything, which I'm really happy about. Uh, obviously, we overtook here, and we followed up with Orlando and uh, got that a feisty competition, which lost so much time that Albon tore up, and they still continue losing time. I got that had a little snap, and I uh, obviously tore up too. Then the bit of fighting so much slowed out uh, and did a bunch up on top of a tar uh, behind it, which is Daphne and Old Horn, so he did a bit of what stick tar in the other train, what five, we don't have Mando, it's Mando, we have no the other. So obviously, we got to take the opportunity, but we want to stop tire. We need to like really new it up as much as I can, but by the time we get to lap stick, lap seven. It's going to start to feel really bad and everything. So that's why I need to like, try to be quick as I can. It's in front of it, it's Albon with a medium. So we need to try to challenge him as quick as possible. So I can take the P, uh, P8 and I'll dive down on the inside on the lap tour. Nice absolutely badly overtake on the inside on Albon, which I'm really happy about. And obviously, with a lot of time on the car ahead, to, we have to slow down on lots and avoid transition. And we've got Dashing in, getting the move done on Albon and Alton looking to join the party. But Dashing on the inside, trying to get the move done, but it's Albon is still building with him. But Albon recovered and tightened the position back. This is um, well done to Albon for defending really well. He did not even lock the position, but he didn't know that he managed to stay calm and looking for opportunities that they uh, the defend in we've done that which is uh, good for him and over to lap 5 we've got our bond chasing down now to see when I'm on my side and I'm diving or well, not diving in I'm actually slowing a lot more but it's the other which I'm going to take from him as I'm now getting real to work our bond up more speed but I don't do on bar but it's the other which is really perfect for me so I got that done, and now I've been acting, listening to trying to make a move on the inside. But I got um, a bit of recent line, I've been took a very tight um, recent line, and I compromised that on here. So I obviously knew how to defend, and then the Albon to Albon. We both fired quite often in that season, which is um, Albon obviously fighting with me. It definitely a good side to know that. I am capable, my car is capable of to be able to complete again the hat and obviously we got the Alpine to squeeze by so easily and pairs obviously we can see the pair that mean got a lap to incredible speed in the Alpine to the Alpine are in top four I believe in RD and it definitely like today we're not that amazing change or not the really change with the Alpine and we know last season toward the end part of the season the open acted to switch on big time as I did move down on Pierre Dasling I did right behind my dear bot and as you see there's a debris fly about so I believe I must have damaged his fun ring and I got more of a technician which is I hold my hand up to that was definitely my fault um because I got a bit leading and I did bend too much on Dasling and obviously I taught it a technician so that my uh, obviously my part to okay, to hold up position. on at old Tony nice. should obviously not to Martin, not to Martin but right in the top. So old Tony should we basically just like ah, oh, do you know what? We're not gonna fight him too much, we should let him um, let him do another thing. So we go into the pit for the in lap ten, trying to lap eleven, sorry, uh, lap eleven, one and try. To, to do a bit under the okay, top, I'm trying to, to, to use up as much as I can, and obviously I was late to turn in, so I'm putting on hard tire instead of medium, so medium okay, being on lap 14, and I'm not going to go to lap 14, so there's no point for me to do it, so I was doing it very early with lap 11, put on a hard tire, a Daphne, obviously didn't let it to go by, but I, you know, had that what I always do with that is bomb on the inside to make sure we don't allow Daphne in by. Like we also let him by now because of the other so I'm playing for the clever game with Daphne but if I know once my hard tire switches on I'll be gone from That's him because Daphne's tire is very old, not very old but 
my small order of mine, so I knew I had the opportunity to be able to breeze by from Daphne, and he sure, you know, to stay behind me and everything, so he dumped that the DL that the Jello trials overtake, but we know it's very short the DL that though in this area, the Daphne couldn't overtake them that point. So we obviously I had to try to defend and make up time for okay, so him get ahead to catch up the field ahead. I definitely spun the car around and it now tried to get out of the level of the curb and it got stuck. So that's it. But it actually tried to move. It's a real tip of spinning. It didn't move the car, so it got saved okay, the car so out. The car out. But it definitely so spun the car. car. There was no we damage, there was nothing. So somehow that thing is got stuck another thing so I'm assuming he's not going to be able to wait at all as I was correct about that he got disqualified for staying on the turn and it took a move which is not it's a real shame for that I mean, that happened to him uh, never happened I've never seen it before in the game so it's the first time I've seen it that we did uh, obviously from the restart map is P1 and then lap 15 we now join up to P10 to that over to the top of the car behind did I always do like a massive dive bomb because I'm not back there to do it I dropped that comfort to be able to do it my hard tie is swish on but I knew I had the opportunity to be able to do it quite easily and we got loads and loads of tires that actually pretty for stop the um, medium to hard the understatement the car so obviously they be able to stay the position as I dive down on the inside, overtaking Valdi Bokta in lap 18. But I do overtake because I need to get up really quickly and I'm on P9. So I knew that it's pretty much P9 is very, the only position I can actually keep at Bokta now getting a move done on me on the outside at the know got the down with the DL I think the DL was activated, I'm not quite sure sure we now, yes it deactivated now and I'm now trying to get back at but that to, we got uh, Nick the Freeze behind and Nick the Freeze obviously I believe he, re I'm not sure if he returned but obviously uh, well for the William I think now done by yeah, in the lap corner so Nick the Freeze uh, managed to out okay, like me, which is quite embarrassing. He's consistently Nick the Freeze finish most of the race of the season behind me the past two seasons. So it's a bit of a embarrassing show, but he's driving leading really well so far for McLaren. Uh, he acted the places for uh, for Doc Who, the Oster Piaf, the Oster Piaf, the Nelak, the Joe Axel Martin. So over the lap 20 into 21, we got Nick the Freeze. Uh, Going to try to challenge, but that and I'm obviously okay, expecting to have a the DL, but but it must like none of us have the DL, and we got um, both of them real to real side by side. As we're going to the third corner, I'm actually trying to go down on the inside, had a little tap with but that real, and I got the overtake done on but that for P10, but I'm very happy about and we got new to Tonona join the party to get overtake and to overtake. About the bot that on the outside, then he get the group racing line, this like probably real as he got ahead of about the bot that. So, well done to Mita Tanona, who had left Alpha Tower to join uh, the Alpine and got steered to your power, spin the car out, and he stay still on the track. And I'm surprised there was no call out for State Mutar, VXD, or Red Flash, if that very dangerous. How he stays in position like that, I thought you see a bomb by him. And it's dropping down the order to underneath P30, P14. So we make mistake with P4, dropped okay, that like, 10 clear. position down. And I'm surprised there was no tool out on that um, incident because I was expecting another flat or something, but it turned out there was nothing. So it's a bit um, a weird one. So they obviously don't know the car going by him. We've got out on, he got done up in smoke, so he's out of the way with Metallator Fainer, which is a shame for Alexander Albon, third race of his season, he's stuck in season with the team, and he's out of the way. So we had a good fight with Albon, but it should more than uh, doing the last one. So unfortunately he's out of the way, and we got Alpine Nuti Tanona diving out on the inside, as I gave him room 
but I um, no try to keep position at well try to catch up the three as the literally nearly really twenty and Nuti has gone by as I'm now getting behind the slip stream and I made mistake for crashing okay? into Nuti Tanona and I had completely destroyed my car because I went behind him. Um, to be fair, I didn't really think he was breaking that early. I was actually breaking, but he broke much more earlier than I did. So unfortunately, I made mistake, so I'm out of the race. Yet another historic win under their belts. Well done to the whole team at Mercedes. Tell me, Ant, how do you think they were able to deliver such an incredible result today? Well, they certainly stood out as a drive with tons of confidence on the track. I think their ability to keep their cool, even during some of the more hectic parts of the race, meant they were able to capitalise on the mistakes of other drivers, giving them the opportunity to make their way to the top spot with ease. After an excellent performance at the Grand Prix, I'm sure there'll be plenty of celebrations tonight amongst the Mercedes team, and they certainly deserve it. As you see, we've got uh, Bolton McDavid on the podium, and Leclerc has won his third race with McDavid. So, well done, Leclerc. And we've got Matt P2 and George Russell P3. So, it maybe took me McDavid um, in the start now. We, we know last season we had a top of McDavid on, uh, with a win, but not as much um, at uh, my team was it who? Oh, Louis Hamilton won last season, so I did that might be wrong. But it, it, it does feel like it's been like trying to swap in win last season, which it actually did happen. So we got Charles P1, Matt P2, George P3, and Oscar P actually done really well, facing P4, and unfortunately P20 and Theo, the P11, which is half night, and we are in touch at the P8. With that to the on the target, so we need to make sure we maintain that target and obviously try to get some point and maybe try to improve get up to P7 stick because I know I'm not loaded completely down to the top of the shots yet, but I do know I got the opportunity to be able to do leaving well this season to make sure I need make no mistake whatsoever, which I did in the third late, which is a shame. So we got it to the end of here, getting ready to head over to Australia. So um, thank you for watching, please like, dislike, turn the notification bell on and peace out.